Welcome back, one and all, to what appears to be the end of this world as we know it. Well, in small room form. Anyway, last time, the evil gang of people, Satoros Minardi and their two friends, Alex and who is Felix, happened to come in and just take our three elemental stars from us. And when we went to go get the fourth, hell broke loose. And... Now we're talking with a giant eyeball thing, known as the Wise One, to get out. Isn't that sad? No home for the stars to return to. See, this is where the game kind of takes a turn, a little bit. I've never heard of a game using a lighthouse outside of the actual lighthouse terms. Here we go again. Use your magical powers! Thank you, good sir. Looks like he's losing it a little bit. Yep. He can't keep it. See, the wise one had the ability to warp us out the entire time, and yet he didn't. We're out of the chamber, and the door is closed. We will never be coming back here. Now, there is no time limit here. But you can either run out manually. Yeah, it won't take you immediately out. You can run, or you can use Isaac's retreat. Synergy. Which is usually a good idea. So you just run out from here. Run! Back to Vale. Everyone's watching as their little mountain starts to blow its top. So did everyone else, bub. And they thought we were mountain climbing. Somebody let the cat out of the bag. We're suspects. Nice. Now we should go back up. Are you stoned? Busted. Sure, if that's what you want to call it. It's like we're walking to our execution. The entire town knows what we've done, sort of, kind of, maybe. Yeah, for emoticons! Yep. Can't say. Huh. <laughs> yes, yes it is. And we go! Just kind of leaving everyone else out here. As the mountain blows up. And now, we see a lively little toy in action. Running. I don't know what they're trying to reenact here. I, I honestly don't. There's a lot of jumping around. I don't know if words are being exchanged. Yes, Isaac can talk. You just never see it happen. And again, I don't know what that is. It looks like a really cockeyed infinity symbol. 
And now they're walking in place. I don't get it. Yes, they are. Well, again, yes, they can be. Of course he will. Hmm. Yes, big hovering eyeball thing. Uh -huh. They're reinstating things that we already know. Then why did we just spend the last two minutes kind of showing them what happened? I don't know. Very solid question, Dora. I mean, it is kind of blowing up. That's no crap moment. Well, ain't he a stand-up guy? The village is safe. We don't have to run for our measly little lives. Yeah, what could be worse than the destruction of a small mountain village? Small-minded people. Well, yeah, they are pure essence of the four elements. I mean, it makes sense. Again, like, it's an uh, easy enough concept to jump into, but the fact that lighthouses can bring about the end of the world is just kind of staggering. At least for me. Yay! Executioner's block. Okay, who didn't see that coming? He is God. He has spoken. Yep. Now, here's a cute little thing. If you say no, it's game over. So just say yes. I'm not joking. If you say no, then the game ends. Right there. You didn't leave. That's it. End of game. Woohoo! Speak to us, oh god. Hi, god!
So basically what they're saying from that point on is you could track them and well story wise you could track them by holding the Mars Star. I think that's what the wise one did when he made you pull it out of the bag. The Jin another concept that this game has. Consider them accessories. Well, there are actual accessories, but these are particularly awesome. I'll get into them when we find our first one. But yeah, we have been issued with the quest to save the world. And there goes the spiritual leader of the village just walking out. What a good guy. And of course the little priest follows suit. Yeah, we're pansies, let's go. Speak some sense, mum. Nope, not really. Yeah. Now, this is kind of a high emotion time, because remember, Dora lost her husband three years ago, and now her son is leaving. I, I just find her resolve in the entire situation pretty big. The mayor doesn't really have anything to lose. Garrett has a little brother and, and I think a little sister. I don't know if she's little or older. But I know there is the little brother. I don't know if, it, if his sister is older or younger. And here are two kids the next morning gossiping about Isaac and Garrett about to leave. Little dog runs around. That's funny. Wait for it. It'll come in a few minutes. Seconds, whatever. What? Bitch! What kind of mom would just not see her son off? That's kind of... dick. I think I caught the cat. Did you see that? Ha! Oh, and you too, Garrett. The world is in your hands. We have faith in you, Isaac. And Garrett too, I guess. I think it's little sister. And we get an herb from her. Awesome. Do you now. Family gang up. Catch beads. Yeah, we gotta scoot this up. Come on. And so, with sad faces, we leave Vale. The shaking is the ROM, not me. Well, this is it, the world map. And we see that little bouncy thing in the corner. Well, we'll get to that. This is Venrir, and the quest officially begins. Will be waiting us? We'll find out. See you all next time.